Good morning, Floodgate guys. Dave Devaney here. And John Hemke from the Men's Ministry. And we're here to announce a couple of events coming up this fall. So our first event is going to be the Men's Breakfast on September 17th. We're asking all the men to be there by 8 o'clock for breakfast. And on top of that, we're going to have plenty of bacon. I love bacon. Everybody loves bacon. Hey guys, our second event is going to be a golf outing at Heartland Glen Golf Course, just down 59 on October 8th at 9.30. We're going to have burgers, we're going to have prizes. And John, do you golf? Dave, I've never golfed a day in my life. Floodgate men, it doesn't matter. We're going to have a great time of fellowship. Even if you don't golf, we want you to come out and fellowship with us, and we're going to have a great time. So guys, I'm encouraging everyone to please be at the men's breakfast on September 17th. And I'm encouraging everyone to come out to the men's golf outings. Because we're just going to have a wonderful time at both. Yes, we are. Amen, brother? Amen. Amen. It's my favorite time of year. Fall is coming, and that means women's Bible study is starting back up. And I'm excited because we're going to be studying the book of Isaiah with video curriculum by Melissa Spolstra, and I will be extending this teaching portion of it, which I'm really excited to do. Our study begins on Thursdays at 10 a.m. and 7 p.m. on September the 15th with childcare available at the 10 a.m. session. I hope that you can join me and all of the gals that are part of the study. It's a wonderful time of opening up the Word of God and learning new things together, but also just the fellowship, the worship, and the great time that we have together. So join me this fall for Isaiah. We would like to invite you this fall to a brand new marriage study called Marriage and Mindsets. This isn't just for married. These are for people who are considering marriage, preparing for marriage, or in a dating situation. The study begins September 19th in the gym, 7 to 8.30. Are there snacks included? There are snacks. We're going to have healthy snacks because as you're married, you grow. Oh, are you telling me I'm growing? Oh, you definitely oh. are. <laughs> okay, guys, it's easy. Just say to your girl, hey, girl, let's try that new marriage study this fall. Okay, honey. See how easy it was? We'll see you then. Lindsay, 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 I must know. Have we rescheduled our church picnic? Because Pastor Bill promised me I was going to get together and hang out with my friends. Yes, Meredith, we did reschedule our church picnic. It's today, after our second service at 2 p.m. at our new property. I'm so excited we get to go to the new property. That's going to be amazing. But what about food? Because see, I put Frederick and Abigail in the freezer so I can fold them out to bring them to grill. And I also need to know if I need to bring a side dish to pass. You do need to bring your own meat to grill still. And the Cornish game hens would be a great choice. We also would love if you'd bring a side dish to pass. Oh, this is going to be so great. Okay, last question is, are we still going to do baptisms? Because I have a lot of friends that were really looking forward to having the sin don't right out of them. We'll absolutely be doing baptisms. If you are already scheduled to be baptized, we still have you on the list. And if you're interested in being baptized, you can contact the church office. Oh, this is just going to be the best time, Lindsay. I cannot wait to get together for our rescheduled church picnic. See you there. Our fire night prayer and worship service will not be happening tonight due to our church picnic. However, it will be rescheduled to next Sunday, September 11th at 7 p.m. This will be a special service of worship and prayer where we get to pray for our families, our church, our country, and remember those who passed all those years ago in the tragedy of 9-11.